Airline flights will soon be more efficient. KPI x 5 Skid Doe has more on the new technology from researchers at NASA Ames coming to an airport near you. We have all been there before, sitting on the tarmac, waiting for who knows how long. But now some researchers from NASA, right here in the Bay Area, say that will soon be a thing of the past. In the air, it's a well-choreographed aeronautical ballet in the skies. But on the ground, it's more like hurry up and wait. When the flight is ready to push back, the ramp control will just push that flight back, and then they'll sit on the surface with their engines on and burn about 25 pounds per minute. Yes, a plane sitting on the tarmac burns 25 gallons of jet fuel per minute. But all that is about to change. And there is a better way. We are inside a NASA simulation of the American Airlines ramp control tower at Charlotte. Charlotte Douglas International, where they have been testing new software called Airspace Technology Demonstration 2, or ATD2. The software coordinates all the arrivals and departures and surface traffic on the ground and sets an actual pushback time. The result, the plane is waiting at the gate with the engine off. The software has been tested at Charlotte since 2017 for just a few hours a day, holding flights on average about five minutes, and it has added up. At Charlotte, over a four-year period, we saved um, about 7 million pounds of fuel over four years, and so that's a significant amount of savings to the airlines. NASA calculates that saving 7 million pounds of fuel reduced CO2 emissions by 23 million pounds, the equivalent of 172,000 trees. And what's more, the planes can actually wait at the gate with the door open. There's a chance that you might get a couple extra minutes of cushion time. Yes, we use that time to keep the doors open to connect additional passengers and additional baggages. It just makes it for a much more enjoyable experience for the passenger. You're going to push back from the gate. There's not going to be any stopping all the way to the end of the runway and all the way to its cruising altitude. NASA does research that helps people. Um, it actually helps life on Earth. In Mountain View, Kit Doe, KPIX 5.